This will be a short demonstration video for installing and configuring Acrobit using the ePhone system. First of all, you need to open up your App Store and then you're going to go to the search options here at the bottom and type in Acrobits. See the spelling? A-C-R-O-B-I-T-S. Alright, first result on the list will be Acrobit Soft Phone. You're going to click on Install. It will bring up the application specifications and click on Install again. Alright, from there on, I'm just moving it to a separate desktop quickly. You're going to wait for the download to uh, finish. Right, after the installation is completed, you're going to open up the application. And first you'll see a welcome screen with all the uh, SIP providers. You're going to select generic SIP account. And you're going to uh, just put your username in there. The one that was received via SMS when signing up from our website and also the password okay uh, domain is going to be sip as in sip dot v the number four m m for mama and then server one word dot com Okay, uh, the title for this account you can give it ePhone, so e -phone, phone and you're going to go to advanced settings. Right, first things first, you're going to need to set up your codex. Uh, initially you'll see the G729A codex is not available. This is an in-app purchase, so you're going to select done. You're going to go back to settings and then under the add-on section in the under the basic settings, select add-ons. It will load a list of additional add-ons into the application. You will click on G79 and it will go through an in-app purchase process, which is basically just you pay for the G79 codec. Um, I've already got this on my account, so I'm just going to select restore, put in my account password again. Now I've got the codec available. Right. Um, go back to settings, go back to my SIP account, ePhone, and then under advanced settings, you're going to set the codec to use G729A uh, right at the top as a preferred one. If you'd like to, you can remove all the other codecs because our server does not use these at the moment and you're going to go through the same process for codex using 3G and you send to 9 right at the top and then you can disable most of the other codex as well you basically just hold your finger and then drag it to the disabled list right done and if you select done it will say signing off registering at the top and if everything went well it will say ephone registered there's your e-phone ready for a call. Thank you.